welcome back to Stacks and Stuff. I hope everybody out there is having a great day. So, I had a little extra money, but better yet, I had a little extra free time. So I went on down to my local coin shop, which is located on the main part of the boulevard out here where I live. And there's a lot of good restaurants, a few bars, a few shops, but there is a lot of city art or street art, if you will. So I had some time, I went walking around, I took some footage, and I thought you guys may enjoy that. If you're into art, stick around, because at the end, I'm gonna be showing that off. But first, let's get into what I picked up at my LCS. All right, and here it is. This thing is very cool. Check that out. A hefty, hefty little piece. Now what we're looking at is a 3-9 pure silver commemorative medal. And I don't know much about this thing other than what it says on this itself. It is numbered number 81. I don't know who made it or how many of these were even made, but very cool. An odd weight, a heavy piece, weighing in at 5.33 troy ounces of 3.9 pure silver. And the two gentlemen right there are the 28th president of the United States, Mr. Woodrow Wilson, and his vice president, Mr. Thomas R. Marshall. Check that out. That's when they assumed the presidency was in 1913. We've got the seal of the president of the United States and the seal of the vice president of the United States. Very cool. And this thing has been artificially antique. You could tell. Very nice. I'm not sure when this thing was made. I don't know anything about it. All I know is 3-9 pure silver. It is number 81 and it weighs 5.33 troy ounces. But very happy to add this to my stack. I need to do my research, find out what I got here, how many of these were made and who made it. But like I said, if you guys know, please help me out. Throw a dog bone, comment in the section below. But yeah, a hefty little piece Very cool. Very, very cool. So now I can add this to my other five ounce silver rounds that I have, which I so happen to have right here. Let me show you. Which is two of these five. Troy ounce silver Scottsdale buttons. These things are awesome. I like these a lot. Five Troy ounce button, three nine fine silver Scottsdale mint. Right there in the middle, we've got the Scottsdale lion. I like Scottsdale mint a lot. Really appreciate their work. And I know CGB Coins Matt also appreciates Scottsdale Mint. And he probably would love to give this thing a bath and some liver of sulfur. And he's probably saying right now, tone it. But Matt, sir, my friend, I like my silver shiny. But I do appreciate a good tone. But check that out. Yes, I got two of these a little while back. I actually traded in a 10 Troy ounce Scottsdale stacker bar for these two buttons. 
That's one good thing about my local coin shop is they also do straight up trades. And that's what I did in this case. You gotta love these, these pucks, these buttons. Five Troy ounce button from Scottsdale Mint. And another five Troy ounce silver round that I own is this piece here. That gentleman right there is Mr. Running Antelope, the Silver Chief. This thing is a hefty piece. It is also numbered, numbered 3,431. Love this piece. Also picked this up at my LCS a few years back. And this has uh, been in my stack and I don't think it's ever gonna be going out. But check that out, it is scratched up. That is how I got it. I think somebody tried polishing it with something. Because check that out, those, those scratches on there. Fine scratches, but they're there nonetheless. You gotta be careful with fine silver. You gotta treat it. Treat it like a baby. But check that out. I really like this thing, the detail. On that is incredible. Running antelope. The Silver Chief. Look at that. All right. And those are the five Troy ounce silver rounds that I have. And now I could add this one to the stack. But while I was up there at my LCS, I did some walking around and I took some footage of some local city and street art that is up there. So guys, check this out. I hope you enjoy.
that's all I got for you guys today. But I would like to thank each and every one of you for stopping by and watching my videos. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're new, consider hitting that red subscribe button down there. I'm going to be making a lot more of these and I would love to have you along for the ride. All right, guys, until next time, take care.